What's up, y'all? I'm gonna do another uh first impression video. I got the truck running, so hopefully it's not too noisy. But uh, let the car warm up while I do this uh first impression. But uh, it's gonna be on new Tasha Dragon Sweet Chili. Let's get our thumbnail. <laughs> yeah, I have been seeing these, but I haven't tried them. Um, uh, gonna go to hot meter. It's almost up there. I think that's about the same amount as regular tacos, if I can get it out the sun or the light. That's about the same amount as the regular chili lime tacos. But uh, yeah, we're reading the nutritional facts and we're reading the ingredients, y'all. Say about 10 servings per container, serving size one ounce, 28 grams, about 12 pieces. The amount per serving calories, 150. Total fat, eight grams, saturated fat, one gram. Trans fat, zero grams, polyunsaturated fat, 2.5 grams. Monounsaturated fat, 4.5 grams. Cholesterol, zero milligrams. Sodium, 150 milligrams. Total carbohydrates, 17 grams. Dietary fiber, one gram. Total sugar, one gram, including one gram added sugar. Protein, two grams. Vitamin D, zero MCG. Calcium, 14 milligrams. Iron, zero milligrams. Potassium, 111 milligrams. The ingredients, corn flour, processed with lime, vegetable oil, canola, and palm oil, seasoning, malodextrin, sugar, salt, potassium, chloride, dextrose, hydrolyzed soy protein, uh, acetic acid, citric acid, natural flavors, yeast extract, spice, red 40, lake, yellow six, lake, uh, uh, yellow uh, six lake, uh, paprika extract, cayenne pepper sauce, cayenne pepper, ooh. vinegar, salt, garlic powder, uh, powder malodextrin, natural flavors, uh, uh, silicone dioxide, disodium and cinnate, disodium guanolate, and silicon dioxide. So the first time I ever tried like the regular Takis that everybody fell in love with, I didn't do no first impression video. So I've never read what's the ingredients on the back of those. I'm guessing it's probably similar to this with a with a little tweak. And those are the, the Fuegos, and these are called Dragon Sweet Chili. Uh, and then it says contains soy made in facility that may also use peanuts, milk, egg, and wheat. Let's see. I don't see it saying nothing, anything special. Sweet chili pepper flavored tortilla chips. Let's crack them open, see what they smell like. Put some hand sanitizer on. Okay. Just looking at these, they look a little they not as they don't look as flavorful as the fuego taki. I'm just looking at them. Them fuego taki, they so red, them suckers, they they popping out at you. But let's let's look at these real quick. Y'all can see it's kind of like orangey. Orangish red. Not quite the color of Garfield. Kind of close though. And they smell like regular Takis to me. So let's give it a taste. Okay. This isn't what I was thinking and they got a little kick to them and they definitely don't have as much flavor as the Fuego Takis. I'm trying to think what these taste like, y'all. The more I'm eating them, they getting a little kick to them. But nowhere near as spicy as the Fuego Takis. I can almost say they're a little bland. They taste more like tortilla chips. The tortilla chip flavor is kind of overpowering the dragon sweet chili. Even though they are sweet and they got a little spice to them, but these don't compare compare nowhere to the Fuego um, brand, any of the Taki chips. It's an, it's an interesting flavor. 
Um, and I can't quite put my hands on what it tastes like. You definitely get some sweet. It's 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 kind of weird. You're getting sweet and kind of a a hot feeling. And the sweetness is lingering on more than the hot. I'm still getting sweetness in my mouth as I'm eating them more. I can feel a little hotness, but the sweetness is lingering is uh, lingering along. I think I'm gonna start rating stuff. So on a scale of one to five, I'm gonna get these a one. These ain't it, y'all. Even though they're not bad, I'm not gonna. I'm never gonna buy these again. It was specifically just to try them. So I get these a one out of five. But uh, yeah. I got these from Kroger's, y'all. I give them a two out of five. Because the, the flavor is lingering on. It's not a bad taste. Just not as much flavor as I, I thought they would have. When you used to eating Fuego Takis. But uh, yeah. I got these from Kroger's and they were $3.99. All right, y'all. I'll catch y'all later. Y'all be good. All righty.